The Airbus A350 is about 25% more fuel efficient than the earlier Boeing 777-200ER and 777-300ER. That's not a small tweak. That's millions of dollars saved per jet every single year. First, aerodynamics. The A350 uses curved, sharklet style wingtips and a 6 to 1 aspect ratio wing. Its adaptive camber changes shape in flight to stay efficient across climb, cruise and landing. Even the cockpit windows are frameless and curved, reducing drag at the nose. Second, materials. Over half the A350 structure is carbon fibre reinforced plastic. Add titanium and aluminium lithium alloys and you get a lighter jet with lower maintenance needs. Less weight equals less fuel burn, and airlines feel that in their balance sheets. Third, the engines. The Rolls-Royce Trent XWB, exclusive to the A350, produces up to 97,000 pounds of thrust. It's the most efficient large aero engine flying today, with a high bypass ratio that delivers low fuel burn and quiet operation. Compare that to the 777-200ER or 777-300ER, Launched in the 1990s, their GE90 engines were efficient for their time, but the A350-900 burns roughly 25% less fuel per seat than a 777-200ER. And the A350-1000 outpaces the 777-300ER with similar capacity but far lower consumption per passenger per mile. For airlines, that efficiency means millions saved annually per aircraft and a matching 25% cut in carbon emissions. It's why the A350 is not just a moneymaker, but a key part of sustainability strategies worldwide. The A350 didn't just join the market, it reset the standard. 25% better than the 777 classics. But here's the debate. Does it outclass Boeing outright, or is the 777X the true answer?